Hi everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. Today, we will be discussing Docker in 5 minutes. In this video, we have our expert Mathiv who will be executing the basic commands for Docker on Ubuntu. So without further ado, let's get started. So we're going to go ahead and start a demo of how to use the basic commands to run Docker. So to do this, we're going to open up terminal window or command line, depending whether you're running Linux, PC or Mac. And we're going to go ahead and the first thing we want to do is see what our Docker image lists are. So we can go sudo docker images and this will give us, well first we'll enter in our password. So let's go enter that in. And this one now gives us a list of our Docker images. And here are the Docker images that have already been created in the system. And we can actually go ahead and actually see the processes that are actually running. So I'm going to go ahead and open up this window a little bit more. But this will show you the actual processes and the containers that we actually have. And so on the far left hand side, you see under names, we have learn, simply learn, be underscore cool. These are all just different ones that we've been working on. So let's go ahead and create a Docker image. So we're going to do sudo docker run dash d dash p 0 .0 .0 .0 colon 80 colon 80 Ubuntu and this will allow us to go ahead and run an Ubuntu image and this will run the latest image and what we have here is a hash number and this hash number is a unique name that defines the container that we've just created and we can go ahead and we can check to make sure that the container actually is present. So we're going to do so, uh, sudo docker.ps and this will actually show us on there. So it's not in a running state right now, but that doesn't mean that we don't have it. So let's list out all the containers that are both running and in the exit state. So let's do sucker ps a and this lists all the containers that I have running on my machine. And this shows all the ones that have been in the running state and in the exit state. And here we see one that we just created about a minute ago, and it's called Learn. And these are all running Ubuntu. And this is the one that we had created just a few seconds ago. Let's open it up, and there we go. So let's change that to that new doc container to a running state. So scroll down, and we're going to type sudo docker. run dash it dash dash name my um, so this is going to be the new container name it's going to be my docker so this is how we name our docker environment and we'll put in the image name which is ubuntu and dash bin dash bash And it's now in our root, and we'll exit out of that. So now we're going to go ahead and start the new my Docker container. So sudo docker start my, and we'll get the container image, which will be my Docker, my Docker return, and that started that Docker image. And let's go ahead and check against the other running. Docker images to make sure it's running correctly. So sudo docker ps. And there we are underneath name uh, on the right hand side. You have to see my docker along with the other docker images that we created. So this is all about docker in five minutes. If you have any queries in the topics covered in this video, please ask away in the comment section below. Our experts are 24 seven ready to solve all your queries. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.